Pretty Little Liars, Original Sin co-creators give a candid response when discussing the chances of a Season 3 renewal. Making its debut on the Max in July 2022, and featuring a Pretty Little Liars cast that includes Bailey Madison, Chandler Kinney, Zaria, Malia Piles, and Maya Rafiko, the spin-off focuses on a new group of teenage girls who begin to receive ominous threats from a mysterious murderer. The second installment, titled Summer School, continues that saga, hinting that the terror may not be over just yet. In an interview with Entertainment Weekly, co-creators Roberto Aguirre Sacasa and Lindsay Calhoun bring address the possibility of Pretty Little Liars Season 3. Both say they are unsure of the show's future, though hopeful that it will be renewed, as they aim for five seasons. Aguirre Sacasa, who created the long-running Riverdale show, talked about the spin-off's path forward, and Calhoun bring agreed, underlining the focus on horror. Read their responses below. In the Pretty Little Liars, summer school ending, it's revealed that Mrs. Langsbury, Carrie Van Dryest, has been the one terrorizing the titular liars, Imogen, Mouse, Noah, Tabby, and Farron, but she hasn't been working alone. Wes, Derek Klenna, also helped for his own petty and selfish reasons, fancying himself as a visionary filmmaker. Wanting to avenge her rapist son, Chip, who was murdered, Mrs. Langsbury is ultimately defeated along with Wes. In the finale's last scene, however, Dr. Sullivan, Annabeth Gish, is alone in her office. She's looking forward to the success of her upcoming book and refers to the protagonists dismissively as narcissists, which is a bit of a turn for the original Pretty Little Liars character. But in any case, before Dr. Sullivan can celebrate too much, she's brutally murdered. Archie Waters, the villain from season 1, returns and repeatedly stabs the therapist, opening the doors for a possible Pretty Little Liars, original sin season 3. The finale, written by the co-creators and directed by Seidenglanz, functions as a fitting farewell for the new Pretty Little Liars cast in several other ways. But it's clear that, if the opportunity arises, there are plenty more stories to tell and other horror tales to pay homage to. It remains to be seen whether the teen drama joins the list of relatively rare Max originals to get to season 3.